In this video, we'll be discussing about how to buy our test series which can be related to the GATE or which can be related to the UGC NET examination. Now as you can see, uh, this thing does not need any manual intervention. That means you don't have to call us to buy the test series if you are not comfortable. Just go to our website that is www.gatelectures.com and you can see our website will open up. So this is the website that we have. Now on the front screen in the home page we have the video which is going to give you the schedule of the test series and let me pause here so it is uh, you can watch this video to see what is the next schedule of the test series okay Hello everyone. right a part of this what you have to do is you can just go to this sign up box fill the information let us suppose my name is Himanshu I'm going to fill my information Himanshu Kaushik my email id is admin at the rate gate lectures.com Then I can fill my password. Then I can fill my contact number. So it is important to give the contact number because sometimes uh, the test series, if the test is getting delayed, then we can send you information regarding this. Okay. So I'll always try to fill co uh, correct contact numbers here. So don't worry, we are not going to spam you. Then we have courses like for example we have gate course or UGC net course. I am selecting the UGC net course. Select the stream. It is computer science. Assuming that I am from Delhi. I can select the city from Delhi. And I can click register now. Now this register now will take me to the index or you can say to the home page here. So this is the home page here. And um, this entire screen we can go through each and every option here. So uh, this is the in, in notification that you can see here. This is a user notification that we can send you regarding the schedule of the test series. Now here, if you buy the test series, then buy with my test button or my test uh, menu button, you can find out uh, what are the tests that you, you have to give or you can give. And here it is your profile. You can fill all the information related to your profile here. Then uh, you can get documents that we can upload here and the reports of the practice test and you can buy the packages from here so either you can buy the packages from the home screen which shows that what are the latest packages or you can buy the packages from this option and this is showing all the total tests you have bought or how many tests you have attempt attempted and how many test, tests are not attempt, attempted so here if let us suppose you want to buy the tests for gate and UGC net I can just go to the buy package option I can see that this is the UGC net test series option which for which I can see what the slabers or the timings. Now for example here we have uploaded two tests. So all the tests will come according to the dates that are mentioned. Now I can just go to this button buy now. This will take us to the screen which is saying that you can pay by using credit card, debit card, mastercard or any kind of card that you have. Okay, And you can also make payment through the net banking. So just do the make payment button. It will take us to the payment gateway and here you can select you want to pay using credit card, debit card, net banking or UPI or anything else. Now let us suppose I am doing net banking. I can use any of the bank accounts that is mentioned here. So let us suppose I have an access bank account so I can choose access bank and I can click on pay now button. So this will take us to the login screen. Let me enter my details. So now I can pay the fees here. So confirmed. So the fees is now processed. Now as soon as the transaction is successful, then if you go to the home screen, then you will be able to see that this is these are the tests that is available. So here in the, from the latest package option, one package is not there because we have already bought it and here it is a take test option from the take test option let us suppose the first test is digital logic design now this one question that we get most frequently sir let us uh, the first test is on 1st of september now if what if we have missed that test see if you are going to miss a test then still you are going to attempt it the results are generated automatically like for example the first test of digital logic is published on 1st of september but then 
is still available and the results uh, it is still available till 5th of November and you can buy the test series accordingly and you can give the test so this is the first test digital logic design I can start the test click on the start test button it will show the screen entire screen so this interface is very standardized all the government examinations are using the exact same interface and trust me uh, the, uh, you are going to you know, enjoy this entire platform because if you start the test here you can see the entire interface which is very well built which is very well designed so here you can have an option for the calculator if you need it here you have options for the all the uh, questions that you have this entire screen is designed to give you a real life feel of the actual examination scenario like for example if you're giving gate examination or if you're giving any government examination the, in the government examination they are using the exact same exact same platform or you can say exact same interface to give the test okay so i don't know the options here i can just skip the questions here i can uh, look at this so i can uh, skip the questions if i can answer any one of them let us suppose here i answer this and then I uh, click on save and next I'll take it take it to the next screen again I can do save and next I, you can answer here because th there can be two types of question fill the blanks or uh, multiple choice questions or it can be single choice question now I can select the option save and next I can select the option save and next so this way I'll be able to give the examination so you can either go to the entire uh, entire uh, question set all at once if you want to see the question paper just click on this button question paper and it will give you the entire question paper so what are the questions that are available okay you can see all the question papers here and if you click on profile it will show your profile here candidate instructions uh, all the instructions that are available and you can give the entire question paper from this so we have uh, positive marks uh, for correct questions we have ma maximum marks as 2 for negative questions we have maximum marks as 0 0.66 that is for two marks question we can have a questions which are of one marks also okay now after giving some questions let us suppose you have selected these options and if you want to clear it then you can just click on clear response now we can have these questions as multiple choice or single choice questions and after uh, uh, giving some answer let us suppose i'm giving this answer i can click on mark and review so the color of the tab will change all the information that is given here that is for the answered question we have green color for not answered question we have red color and for marked question we have purple color and there are some questions which are not even visited so you can see all these questions from here okay and then i can just click on submit button submit button will end your test uh, let us suppose i am clicking, clicking submit button it will show what is the result that i've scored so for example here the out of 40 questions i've got 50 marks uh, maximum marks the question paper was having 50 marks and i've attempted four questions and i left six questions which is correct answer is one incorrect answer is three and the total time taken by me is two minute 31 seconds uh, correct marks is one and negative marks is minus 1.32 so it is showing the total number of marks that you can they have scored now here this tab is very very important because in this tab you can see the test report solution report time management report and question wise report let us see the first report. The first report is about the test report. So test report will give the total number of candidates who have given this examination is 20. And that uh, my marks is minus 0 0.32. And uh, how many questions I left and all this information is given here. But you can see the total marks uh, map your percentile. So uh, we can have 100% percentile, we can have 95% and so on. So this is actually generated according to the total number of candidates who have given this examination. Okay so uh, i can go to time management so time management will take that uh, how much time i have utilized and how much time the topper utilized for example the topper utilized uh, uh, 25.0 he got 25 marks in 7.26 minutes okay and what are the correct answer i have given and what are the correct answers i have given i can see the question report question report will see for question number one uh, what is what was my answer for question number seven what was my answer and uh, question number seven if you ho if you hover this then you can see the entire question set also this is the question that was question number seven question number nine so it will show all that result what is the correct answer for each and every question and what is uh, the time i've spent in that question so it will give an entire question report apart of this you can also go to the solutions tab solutions tab will show you all these questions that we have answered and I can even 
see the solution so click this is the solution button click on the solution button a new window will pop up which will show you the video solution of that question so let us say i play this video and i will be able to see the video solution for this given question okay so this is the video solution right for every any question here for any question let us suppose this is the question number three i can go to the solution bar so there are two types of solutions number one it can be having a text solution or it can be having a video solution so here a video solution is popping up I can play the video solution to see what is the correct procedure to go through this given question okay and a part of this I can go to compare myself with the other students now here you can see uh, my ranking is 17th out of 20 students who have given the examination my ranking is 17th the topper student scored how many marks he scored uh, 50 percentage marks out of uh, I mean we have uh, approximately 50 marks of the question paper he scored 25 marks so he scored 50 percent the second stopper scored 28 percent mark the third topper scored 27 percent marks so the first stopper is uh, Mr. Abdul Qadir and uh, he's having uh, he scored 25.05 percent marks out of 50 and he is the topper for this examination okay till now so this uh, information will change automatically according to the time okay now i can go to the difficulty level of the question papers uh, there are um, easy questions we have normal questions for that 39 easy question one is the normal question that we can give what is the difficulty level of each and every question that is for our end and here in the difficulty level i can also be see view your test analysis so i can see all the analysis according to this difficulty levels also and i can get you the topic report that means for, for the kmap questions kmap part we have given five questions and how many questions are correct answered by me or how many questions are not correctly answered by me in the same way logic gates we have 14 questions how many questions i have correctly answered by me and how many questions are not correctly answered by me so this is very helpful when you want to see what are the sections where you are having maximum issues or maximum problems like for example here th this entire test is divided into five sections so, so let us suppose in some section you are scoring very good marks but in other section you are not scoring good marks then you can go to your you can exam you can plan your preparation accordingly and you can uh, cover up your weak areas okay so this is the test series platform so go to the home screen button and I can also see there's something called as notifications. So notification will see all the notifications that are sent by me. You can go through the notification notification tab also. Okay. And if you want to buy other packages, you can also contact us. Our contact numbers are also given. If you go to help button, then uh, you can send us at, uh, send message to our technical department or you can send message to the administrator. Okay. So this is also going to help you out right so if you need any other information you can also uh, contact us on the given contact numbers given here okay and i hope this video is helpful for you while how to buy the test series and how to give the test okay so all the best